Can I can I intimidate the train to stop it? I walk away. This time. Okay, Floki didn't die. Yet. I call this a success. <laughs> the Floki drinking game. Every time Floki does something that would get him killed and Martin doesn't allow it, take a shot. You know, yeah, grab the bike all over there. Like. Yeah. <laughs> and after a, after a few seconds, your train actually crashes and derails. What? It's a good... Oh no. Is Mordon still taking his shit? Okay, so basically every one of you get knocked out for just about a minute before waking up again. I get knocked out with a natural 20? You you were on the toilet, so you're not covered in shit. That, that's your luck. That's that's your luck right there. You do wake up with your pants up. Okay. And, you, and your ass is white. Okay. <laughs> Alright, I'm fine with that. I yell, help me or I'll stab you. Look. If you don't help, you will stab you. You have no choice. It's the perfect plan. I don't have anything to tie him up with. <clears throat> I can use my web. You, you, yeah, I was about to say, you have a bondage cleric with yeah. you. Yeah. Um, Excuse me? I'd like to go back and get Hazana. And the half orc like, reaches into his satchel, and he pulls up a what seems to be several sticks of dynamite. Oh, I thought you were about to say rectal probe. Also that. <laughs> and also that. <laughs> Mordon quivers a little bit <laughs> at the dynamite. Not at the, not at the rectal probe. So, jibs on whatever's inside. Jibs? No, no, mate. Excuse me? I don't have any chips. I pull out my axe. I don't have any chips. If you want to eat something, wait for a few, a few minutes. No, 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 no. I'm calling jibs. On whatever is inside. I don't, I don't have any food. Jesus, give me a second, mate. So about 11 seconds after everybody gets to the other room, uh, cart, you hear a loud explosion from the from the other car, and what sounds very clearly as a large metal doll, doll, door falling off its hinges. Someone stop him! <laughs> <laughs> Quality voice acting. That's that's most half-hearted. Somebody get him. You might have not noticed, but there's still a bunch of murderous guards out there. Yeah, but there's a really buff orc right here. Look, just let the halfling squirt your friend with twist. It just tingles a little bit. It just tingles a little bit. I swear, every single one of you is fucking insane. I cannot really argue with that. I have better chances of evading 20 murderous guards alone than a group with a fucking half-wit, a half-idiot, standing out demon, and a fucking drow. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, who's who? Martin, my eye potion squirter, it's based on like the vodka pseudoscience. Can I squirt it up the butt too? I'm leaving. I walk out of the drain. Martin, you know, cause you know how people also like put vodka up their butts. I know, I know. Right? And it's even faster that way. Well, maybe, it depends. All right. So, I own this guy now, right? No. I mean, I did call dibs. <laughs> nope. <laughs> and he said it was okay. I've never had a slave before. <laughs> the driver might be a, a gnome. I don't think he'd see the road. I can't reach the panels. <laughs> He's got little extendo feet. After you asked that, the troll see, uh, troll, half orc. The oh, troll. Yeah, the troll is driving the car. That's a really short troll. I mean, at least my party members don't get locked up in the back of a train, eh? Well, I don't know. Looks like your guys got shut up pretty bad. I'm fine. Yeah, he's fine. You're bleeding on upholstery. It's just a flesh wound. It's a flesh wound. <laughs> oh, that's, that's lovely. He's being sarcastic. <laughs> Mordon sits on one of the uh, the bar stools and just wiggles his legs. I think we need a children's chair. <laughs> a kitty chair, like on the, the little toddler thing. Like a stool. Yeah. yeah. A car seat. <laughs> and he wiggles his legs. Well, no, that's that's why the bar stools are already pretty high. The, usually, the, like the bar will be up here, and the bar stool will be like right here. I think you should have to make a um, a climb check a climb to get in. To get in. <laughs> 
Martin, I would like to make a perception check to see if I can find any good tea. Like, if I can see any. Can I use craft alchemy to make a mint julep? You don't have anything to make it with. We're in a speakeasy full of alcohol. You can you can reach the shelves. So, who'd you rip this off? Well, the mayor, for start. And that can be good. No, not at all. Oh, Mayor Johnson? I certainly didn't vote for him. <laughs> no, Mayor Richard. Mayor no, Richard? Oh, I certainly didn't vote for him. I definitely didn't vote for him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's a bit of a dick. Did you just call Mayor Richard a dick? Because I appreciate that, thank you. Okay, okay, what's what's the plan again? Immediately. What do we do? Detergent. Shut up with Shut the up. detergent! <laughs> I'm driving. Have you even... Uh... Well, the wheel? Not, not to point any fingers, but as a barbarian as you are, do you know how? If he doesn't know what detergent uh, that's racist. is, <laughs> I don't think he knows how to drive. Well, that's just offensive. I'm just surprised you had you did not attack the armored car yesterday. Of course, I know how to drive. Okay, so he starts babbling in con incoherent, rapid speech, and he's basically just a pile of very, very sad man on the ground. It's also like a vine. 